Okay, this is All Quiet on the Western Front, um, Lesson 6, Talk and Must Talk. And uh, this lesson is all about the concept of intertextuality. So intertextuality is uh, really a fancy literary criticism word for um, this connection that's going to exist between a text and another text um, that um, shapes or influences or deepens the audience's understanding um, or experience of or attachment to or enjoyment of the text that's being read. So um, when I'm using the word text here, I'm, I'm not just talking about a written text. It's not just about like a novel or a short story. Um, it could be a movie. It could be a TV show, a video game, a song. Um, literary critics um, and cultural critics will also use text to refer to things like your own experience walking down the street, uh, advertisements you see, um, political discourse, anything like that. So I'm going to use text in a really, really broad sense here. Um, and reading a text then would mean um, experiencing that text or consuming that text. So if the text we're talking about is, um, uh, you know, Tiger King on Netflix, then to read the text would be to sit down and watch that show. Okay, if the text we're talking about is, um, I don't know, a piece of music, um, some awesome song, reading that text is going to be listening to that song. Um, so in this case, we're going to be talking about three pieces of written text. We've got All Quiet on the Western Front and then a short story by Tim O'Brien and a poem by Thomas Hardy. Um, so reading those texts, I think is going to be pretty un easy to understand, but just understand uh, now that you know, when we're talking about intertextuality, there could be, you know, a connection between a film and a short story. Um, you know, you could be watching a movie and there will be reference to a video game. Um, so just keep that in mind. All right. So intertextuality, again, is this interconnection between a text and another text that influences or shapes the audience understanding and experience of the text that's being read.